Hey what's up guys, welcome to Mr. Week channel. Today I'm going to visit a beautiful town of Worcester. This is in a county of Worcestershire. I've been there actually several times. I have done several videos there. But because it's a big town and it's a beautiful town, I always found different places to go and always I like to share with you. I want to shout out to Ben Higgins. So let's do the video. Stay tuned. And here I am guys in a beautiful town of Worcester. I'm here actually in a race course in Worcester. There's nice races they do come here and even Sky comes here and records it so everybody around the world or in the UK can watch the races. I used to come even when I lived here I think 17, 15 years ago more or less. Um, I used to come and watch the races always as you can see I'm just in front of the VIP area and always for you to come here to watch the races you will have to pay. You will have to pay. Obviously I didn't want to pay you can stay just there just behind uh, normally there's food and people with those betting boxes there but just behind or on the side you can see and watch it for free and uh, that's what I do actually I used to sleep this is quite long maybe two two point something miles more or less and uh, that's what I used to come here and watch races hope you are all okay here we are after now the lockdown lifting that is really nice, but it still feel, feels strange, guys. I don't know about you, it's been really hard. One year with several lockdowns. This has been hard for all of us. If somebody told me this a good couple years ago, I wouldn't believe it, guys. So I hope you are all okay. I'm still not 100% because all of this actually did affect me. What is nice to see is as I came to town, oh my goodness, the town is full of people. Whatever I've been, people, they are responding really quickly. They are coming out. And they are try I suppose to forget my first one after the um, the lifting the lockdown. I went to Cheltenham. I had even the police follow me several times, putting pressure on me. Even you allowed to go out. It was still it still it doesn't make sense to me. They should be after criminals, not after, after Mr. Wig, a very positive and kind person. Anyway, I hope, like I said, you are all okay. Please let's now go out. Very soon the uh, we can go inside a restaurant or even a pub or a coffee shop and have a coffee and eat something guys And yesterday I went to Birmingham and the motorway was full so people they were desperate to go out and you know what? It's us peoples. They will always pick the faults and the mistakes from the government We are ready just to bow to bring the economy up it will be as not the millionaires and rich and forces the poor ones and the middle class like us that will bring this country up Nevertheless, if you are new to my channel, you're more than welcome here I am in the United Kingdom in a race course where horse racing is very popular and famous. Here it will happen in a month or two, I think the first racing. They are preparing the, the, the grounds, what is a good thing. As you can see, there's a big white thing you can see is a plastic. They lie down on the floor because it was floods here. And would you believe it, here you can flood very, very easy. And the water, this is what, one and a half meters high, this white barrier. And uh, the water actually have covered several times when I used to live in Worcester, that's what I used to happen. Actually, it does look good, green already, but you can see some paths, they still little brown-ish. But anyway, I'm here, just 10 yards from the, the ending line. I'm just in front of the VIP area. Let's gonna run. I'm gonna win this race. <laughs> and I won. Mr. Wig won once again, and I passed the line in first. Look at that. Ah, did you see that race? I ran so fast. No horses. I just left them all behind. Oh, they still go there halfway. I'm so fast. So let's see the, the rest of this beautiful city. I am a very popular motorhome. And that is a motorhome, very old one from the 80s, even maybe from the 70s. Wow, you can park here for free. No limit here. So what a good idea. Perhaps they are still sleeping, they cover all the windows because today is warmer but as the sun will go through the windows make even hotter. Oh my goodness, dark green, what a paint. The fair. it's happening here in Worcester, it's going to finish in a couple of days. I do like them. It's six pounds, you can pay actually six pounds to go in 
That is my favorite color in blue. And there's another here. Oh, beautiful. I just love these colors. Beautiful car, Volkswagen Sirocco. Here we are by the river here. Really beautiful properties in here. I had one of those. This is in blue. I had one in black. Really beautiful. And that is a diesel. It's a beautiful part here in Worcester. People, they do like to walk by the river. It's a long river. And there it is. You can eat something. That is the proof. The table's there outside. You don't need to go inside. Even you could go inside. And that is a good thing. So you can go out, eat something or even an ice cream. You can have even a break. And isn't this beautiful? And that's what I'm talking about. So as you can see, you can walk at the bottom as well. And there's McDonald's. Nice, lots of green areas for you to relax, lie down in a beautiful day like today. And obviously in, a, in an hour or two will be much hotter. So as it's getting warmer, Every day I can see the temperature is going up, so that is a good thing. I want to share with you as a guy this from, uh, from America, uh, from Florida. A young guy, he answered his phone with withheld number. So there was no number, no name, and he answered. But the call was supposed actually to be for another person. So this guy said he was enamorated by the angelic voice of this girl on the other end of the line. Actually, they spoke for several hours, would you believe it? He said that she had a voice of an angel. This young lady from Iowa, in America, obvious. This guy was spending his summer in uh, New Mexico, but he knew it deep inside that he wanted to know more about her. They exchanged letters for more or less six months, and they became actually pen pals. <laughs> So he traveled to um, Midwest to meet this mysterious girl with an angel voice. It was love at first sight. And in September this year, they will celebrate their 30th anniversary together. What a fantastic story just as shared. I'm so romantic and these things really touch me. And I think that is so lovely. We can see the seven View hotel by the river, so you're not far away. How quirky is this place? They got rooms as well, so you can stay here. Look how beautiful is this property. I feel sorry for this, the owner of this pub, or because they got rooms, they got accommodation as well. Is they never move? This always gets flooded. Would you believe it? With you, beautiful. There's a nice Saudi TT. Oh, look at that. <laughs> one go that way, the other go this way. Could you live in one of those both guys? Narrow boat heart. I don't think so I could, but maybe I suppose you need to, to prepare yourself mentally. So here I am. And look at that balloon there. Oh my goodness. Could you go in one, guys? I don't know. I, I would like to do, but I'm very scared at the same time. Oh, a hundred pounds. Fine. Look at that. I will show you actually where it was flooded. So I'm on a South Quay. That's what it's called. There's apartments here you can live. But I'm just going to show you. Look where the water reach. That is six foot high. And sometimes it has, it has been higher. But that, that's where you can see. Actually, you can see from the marks of the yellow in this house. But look at that, you can still see perfect. Look, the floods just reach almost that window. So if you rain, you could even be outside. Browns, that is the name of the restaurant. There, there's people waiting already. And all the tables, actually, they are full. They, are, they put like a tent there. What a fantastic idea. So you got all the information, always look up, guys. You will always find this so you don't get lost or you will find the best places actually to go. Look at that church, look at it so high with that tower. Oh my goodness, how did they make those things?
developers in this area. What does that mean? Avian influenza. There you go, if you want some ice cream, you can be there. They put a caravan there. How cool is that? But look at the birds they are on that tree. Wow, they are resting. Uh, you birds. Yeah, emoji. People that you use for text message or emails. And in first place, we're going to put is the pleading face. It's very popular. I do use it myself as well. In second place is the red heart. Really popular with people. In third place, I'm going to put the roll of the flower. In fourth place, I want to put sparkles. But if you put an emoji, it makes a big difference. It makes a big difference. It makes the text message or the email to stand out. And that's why people, they are using them. In fifth place, I'm going to choose the smiling face with hard eyes. I will have to show all these beautiful and quirky and stunning buildings here in Worcester. Really beautiful. People, they live on those ones, as you can see. And that is the college on the left, just by that tree. But all of that, people actually, they do live here. Look how many birds they are here, swans and, oh my goodness, and ducks. Number six I choose is the folded hands. Folded hand. A swan statue here because they take serious um, and they are very precious for the government or for the local government. If you kill one, actually, you could go to prison. And that's what they do, so you can't catch them because some people that kill actually swans, believe it or not. Number seven, I'm going to choose the smiling face with the hearts. The emoji, number eight, I'm going to choose a smiling face with smiling eyes. And the number nine, one of my favorites actually, and I put in number nine, it should be in first place actually, but I call the monkey cover eyes. I just love to put that in so many of my text messages. And number 10, I'll, the emoji that I will choose is the cuddle crying face. Cuddle crying face. I shared with you the, the 10 most popular emojis with yourselves it's October 2019 my goodness you reach here that November 2000 February 2014 there so more or less the same look where the water reach 1960 1965 July 2007 1948 you reached there 1939 1852 December 17 1910 June 2000 1924, November 1832. Oh my goodness, got all the dates here. I just love that. So if you want to, to know more about them, there it is, the record. You reach there. That is nine foot high. Even 1947, almost reached the maximum. 1674, that's, oh my goodness. Some of the houses here, they are stunning. Really, really stunning. So yes, you do need to have some kind of knowledge or you need to be known by the by the people here. And there you go, this is the part of the of the cathedral. Really amazing building. As you can see just the top, I never been there. I think you pay a fiver, maybe three pounds to come here and to to visit. At the moment it's closed, I don't know. I will see the other side. They just put a tent here. And they left it like that. Isn't that fantastic? That is amazing how that thing doesn't fell off. But maybe one day we'll, it will, but I can see they did some kind of a renovation here and there. You wonder if they need something to support and that fell off, that is really sad. So that it was the old part of the, of the cathedral here in Worcester. Beautiful building, as I can show you guys. Really stunning. Why we can't make beautiful things like this these days? As you can see, lots of parts. Those windows, they've been renovated. That pillar, they made a replica of the original, obvious. It still needs a lot of TLC, as you can see. This is a work in progress. This has been going like this for years. See, they have done a lot of work. Once again, those windows, the ones at the top, even at the top, that Oh my goodness, that isn't that high. I can see they've done a lot of work here. This has been for years, they've been renovated. So that window, that window, that window, and that wi window has been renovated. They have to exchange, obviously, the, the glass as well. So it's not just the stone or the cement. I don't know, actually, if they have done with cement. So it would be 
easier, it would be cheaper. Yes, you need to be a voluntary to be a work here in the cathedral. Isn't that beautiful? Just look at that. Oh my goodness, what a fantastic car. The Beamer 728 petrol. And you know, I just love this color. Actually, I had the BMW, the same color with the cream leather inside as it is this. It's my favorite color, by the way. What a nice Porsche here. Fantastic. The sport, beautiful. Sports cars, but with five seat. Oh my goodness. I think this is fantastic, guys. Would you agree? Look at you living here in these beautiful buildings. Look how gorgeous is here. Trees for you to be in the shade. Ah, oh, I reckon here. Ah, oh, they were doing the, the vaccines here. This, look at the entrance for the back for people they live here. And they got these electronic barriers as you, I will show you guys. Oh my goodness, this, you just can't avoid to look. I just think they are stunning with these two towers, twin towers. Yeah, as you can see, it's got like a electronic barrier. So you can't go inside. You'll have like a special card where you will touch there. As you can see, I'm pointing out, it's got those reds, infrareds there. So you touch with a card and the thing will go down so you can go in. And there you go. Was the cathedral. Oh, very quirky to live here. I didn't know if I would like to live here because people, they come from the nightclubs here, they make a lot of noise. Here we are in the grounds of the cathedral. Look at this beautiful building. Mesmerizing. You can spend the hours actually, this is so huge. This is really big. You can spend an hour actually here. Oh my goodness. But they put this special light so you can be able to see it at night, as I'm pointing out. So you can see it much, much better at night time. I know they got several lights in several points. Oh my goodness, look at the amount of work. You just can see in all the windows in some parts like there or at the top. Look at this, really stunning. And there's the main tower. What is that, one o'clock, let's see. Ho oh, ho, look at that. I didn't lie, spot on, one o'clock. That was by the second. What a nice place actually to finish. Guys, I hope you are doing all okay. Hope you're having fun or going out. Even I still don't feel 100%, I'm feeling better that I came out. As you can see, another work in progress day, you know, on a corner. This, you need so much TLC. What a nice to finish by a Porsche 718. And this is the model, the new model now they are doing. So it's more or less the Porsche Boxster, but now they call it the 718. As you can see, you can't go in. What is really sad, I was hoping actually to go inside and take some photos. Just look at the image they had at the top there. Really stunning. Yeah, look at these beautiful properties here. Look at these beautiful properties here. Really, really stunning. Very quirky, very quirky, really stunning. Actually, some of them, they remind me that you are in London. And there you go, guys. I just came to the end of my video. Thanks for watching, really appreciate it. Hope you are all okay. Please subscribe so you don't lose the next video and thanks for watching. I'm doing my best, thank you. I'll see you on the next one, guys.